Shio Sakaki, the karate master, known as the 100th degree street fighter. Apajai Hopajai, the grim reaper of Muay Thai boxing. There's no greater master of Chinese Kenpo than Kensei Ma. Akisame Kuetsuji, jiu-jitsu master and warrior philosopher. When it comes to handling swords and weapons, Shiguri Kosaka is the best there is. Then there's me, Hayato, elder and master of the house. This is a gathering place for martial arts masters who have no patience for the modern trends that turn our sacred discipline into a sport. A place where martial arts are treated with the respect they demand. A den of strength and honor, Ryozan Paku. Well, all righty then. I'll run down to the kitchen and make everybody some tea. Please don't leave me alone with them. Is it just me, or did Miu just dump this kid on us and take off? Nah, Miu. She's like a child who wants to help a bug escape from a spider's web. But when things get a little sticky, she shows her age by running away. <laughs> <laughs> that was a superb analogy. So, what do you think we should do with this little bug? Well, now, I think we should let the bug speak for himself. Are you certain you're ready to receive our teachings? It's a simple question, Kenichi, but I'll ask it again. Will you devote yourself to our training and join Ryozan Paku? <clears throat> yes. I want to be stronger. <laughs> Excellent. Just sign your name on this contract. Sure. You owe us tuition. 20,000 yen a month. <laughs> Way. Ten thousand. Take it or leave it. Oh. I've got your tea. <laughs> Here you go. Oh, thank you. <laughs> thank you. <clears throat> the five thousand, then. The final offer. Is this guy for real? That's enough, Kensei. It's vulgar to beg. Now, now, Akisame. It's all right. The simple fact of the matter is, the dojo has been experiencing some financial difficulty. You've got money problems? I'll take that. Huh? Well, uh, we've managed thanks to Miu's clever bookkeeping. Huh? She's only in high school and she's in charge of keeping your books? Yes, and the laundry and the cooking and the cleaning and everything else. Indeed, without our Miu, we'd Here be a pretty go, pathetic Grandpa. bunch of martial arts masters. Want some? Some sake! Go get it! Oh, no, I can't! If I do, we won't have any money left for food! Oh, really? Then you've left us with no other option. Abatai, I want you to go pawn Mew! Do it now! Kenichi, help me! How can they be so cruel? I'll be here every day to protect Mew from these maniacs! So tell us, what kind of techniques are you hoping to learn here? Well... I've always really liked karate. It would be awesome if we could start with that. I told you I do not take on disciples! Actually, I think it might be best if you taught him, Akisame. Oh, yeah. Do you think so? Yes, he's right. You have experience teaching our disciplines, Akisame. You will make a fine instructor. Besides anyone else, the boy will be dead in a week. <laughs> Don't worry, Akisame's a very good teacher, and he's a really nice man. Really? Are you sure about that? For the most part. <laughs> so this will be the beginning of your training in the martial arts? Uh, yes. A guy at the karate club wants to fight. I think he's gonna kill me. Kill him? I see. So you've got a bully after you. <laughs> I can relate. Believe it or not, I was pushed around, bullied and beaten up when I was a boy. <laughs> Well, jiu-jitsu is the perfect discipline for protecting yourself. And don't worry. Contrary to popular belief, I'm not a strict teacher. Perfect! Sensei! My arms are gonna break! It feels like my fingers are about to rip off! Many have said that, but I've rarely seen it happen. Wait, didn't you just tell me that you weren't a very strict teacher? Hmm? I did, and I'm not. Really? Uh, if this 
isn't strength, and I'd hate to say what is. Now, I think it's time we both took a little break. Let's take a stroll down to Sotomigalka Park. Sotomigalka Park? You can't be serious. That's like three train stops away. Wait, are you telling me I'm supposed to pull this thing and walk? No! <laughs> You'll run. <laughs> You're slow. You're like a turtle. Now run faster. <laughs> He's evil! <laughs> I've met snails that can run faster than you. Pick up the pace. We'll see you guys later. Well, since it's the first day, I decided to take it easy on you. Today was light, but tomorrow's a different story, so get plenty of rest. As soon as the sun comes up, we begin your real training. Night. <laughs> he calls this light? He treats me worse than any bully I've come across. I'm gonna quit. I'm gonna... <laughs> hey, Kenichi. I know this is really tough, but I hope you'll give it your best tomorrow. <laughs> On second thought, I don't think I'll quit after all. Oh, but Jay is so nice that he made you a walking cane. Bye-bye! <laughs> Who would have thought a brute like him had a <laughs> sensitive <laughs> side? What a nice guy. Maybe I should have tried Muay Thai boxing instead. Your head's too high! Keep your hips down low! <laughs> Much better. Now shuffle your feet quickly and move between the posts. This is harder than it looks. How much longer do I have to keep doing this? Uh, it's been nothing but muscle training for two days straight. Enough's enough. When are you going to start teaching me jujitsu? Regardless of what you might think, building your strength is the key. No matter how skilled or trained he might be, an ant can't defeat an elephant, can he? Wait a minute. Are you comparing me to an ant? Perhaps that was insensitive. That analogy is unfair. To the ant. No, you're just making fun of me! I want to quit! You hear me? I've had enough! Kenichi, listen. Despite its meager size, an ant possesses the power to carry items several times its own weight. There is much you could learn from an ant. Um, I know I'm kind of small and I'm not the strongest guy around, but I'm willing to learn if you'll tell me what's next. <laughs> well, let's take a little break. <sighs> All right, now get back to work. <laughs> It was a great idea to pick Akisame as his first instructor. He's giving him excellent guidance. He has disciple. Lucky. <sighs> Moving on. You will now begin your training in Muay Thai boxing. Fun, yes? I think I heard my spine break! <laughs> Maybe I should teach him a few pointers myself. I really don't think my body was designed to contour like this! <laughs> you know, you're a very fortunate boy to have such amazing resources at your disposal. Even a king would be lucky to have so many masters. You called this lucky? I better hurry or I'm so gonna be really So tell us the plan, Daimanji. Are you really gonna fight him, huh? You might want to take it easy on the kid. You'll break those weak knees if you're not careful. Taking it easy ain't my style. We can't have a weakling like him hanging around. The Koryo Karate Club has a rep and I'm gonna keep it. Shirahama's a dead man. I'm gonna beat that little twerp into a pulp and make sure he never steps foot inside our dojo again. Sounds like a plan to me. You notice little sissy boy hasn't shown his face around here lately, right? Yeah, he's probably at home hiding under his covers, wetting his bed. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta do something to help Kenichi. It's a miracle I didn't die today. Hey, Kenichi. <laughs> Miu, what's up? I'm glad I caught you. I have a couple of things I wanted to show you. What? Are you gonna teach me some cool fighting moves or something? Well, sort of, but it's more like a way of walking. Oh. It's called the stepping method. I want you to watch me while I do it first, okay? All right. See that? When the toes come together, it's called koho. And when you pivot out, it's called hi-ho. Um, okay. You know, it might be easier if I just let you try it. Here's what we'll do. This might seem weird, but I want you to attack me. <gasps> I won't do it! If you think I'm the kind of guy that would hit a girl, then you're nuts. Forget it. That's noble in a weird sort of way. All I really want you to do is try and touch me. Oh! What? You want me to touch you? 
touch you? Yeah, just come at me and I'll teach you a trick. So I can really touch you anywhere I want? Right. He's creeping me out. What the heck was that move? Did you see what I did to you there? The key is how you move your feet. Now that I've stepped forward with my right foot, I can put all of my weight on it, and that leaves my left foot free. So I can pivot like this. You're using your footing to get around to the other side of your opponent. You leave your upper body in place until the very last moment. And by quickly pivoting away, you can easily avoid your opponent's attack. Okay, let's see. I point the tip of my right foot towards my left foot. <laughs> right, um... <laughs> hey, maybe we should just focus on moving one foot at a time for now. Yeah. Just take a deep breath and stay focused. If you lower your stance, you won't fall down. I give up. There's no way I can do this. I don't have what it takes. I'm gonna squash you like a little bug. Even if I get this down... There's no way that I'll ever be Daimonji. If that's the way you feel, then maybe you should consider running away while you still have the chance. But what am I supposed to think? If I step in the ring with him, I guarantee you I won't make it out alive! There's no such thing as an absolute guarantee in fighting. You don't know what'll happen unless you try. Yes, I do! I'm gonna get the crap beaten out of me! If you saw his muscles, you'd be scared too! You're right. The way you're acting, you're probably gonna lose. Try to be more optimistic. You haven't even fought yet, and you've already lost your spirit. She's right. I've given up. My entire life, I've always been a quitter. <laughs> That's right. There's one thing I almost forgot to tell you. where he is. Kanichi's always running late, but he's never been this late. Maybe he's laying low for a while to avoid that bully. Oh well. It's his life. He can do what he wants. If he decides to run away, then that's his choice. I can't change his hey, mind. Look. How creepy. What Koho. in the world is he doing? Hi-ho. <laughs> Koho. Hi-ho. Koho. I didn't think you'd come. Hey, Miyu, I'm sorry I'm running so late. I walked all the way from home like this. I gave myself an extra hour, but it looks like I'm still behind. Uh, hey, Miyu, listen. I'm definitely gonna be late, so you go on ahead. I don't want to make you late. You don't have to wait for me, okay? I'm gonna walk to school like this every day. You're crazy if you think I'm actually gonna leave you by yourself. <laughs> You're my friend. I'm staying by your side. I walked every day for an entire week. I trained hard and pushed myself to my limit. After a week of blood, sweat, and tears, I was able to master two techniques. I can do this and this. That's it! First I do this, then this. That's all! Shirahama, you got some nerve showing your face in my club. Uh, well, we, we agreed we'd meet in a week, so I thought... You fool! Go home! There's no way you're gonna beat me. You should run away while you still can. Well... I'll never know if I don't try. Oh, really? <clears throat> Since you seem to have a death wish... <clears throat> I'm more than happy to help you. All right, then. I'll be the referee for the fight. Do it, Daimonji! Teach him a lesson he'll never forget! Begin. I'm definitely gonna die! Out of bounds. Oh, you just Man. totally annihilated Man, him. Man, that was hardcore. <laughs> this is awesome. What do you want to do, kid? You want to give up? No. No, I... I'm not done. Just keep it together. Give up.
give it up already. Yeah, you got a death wish? He's gonna destroy you. Begin. <sighs> what did Miu say? If you try to avoid an attack, you'll end up in an even more dangerous position. You have to step forward before your opponent's momentum builds, got it? Now remember, you have to be sure to wait until the last moment before you make the move. Step too early and it's not gonna work. That's it! Okay, step... And pivot! What? He just disappeared. When did you... <laughs> You're gonna break your hands on these pegs of steel. You're gonna end up hurting yourself a lot more than me, punk. You want out, kid? No, I'm fine. Begin! <laughs> Attacks. We aren't facing him! You idiot! You can dodge all day long, but you won't win! You can't win! You fool! He's right about that! What am I gonna do? You're not gonna beat me if you don't fight back. I'm in trouble. If he lands a single punch, I'm done for! Oh, man. Daimonji's hits are powerful, but the kid's just too fast. I know. If this keeps up, Daimonji's gonna wear himself out. He has to have had some kind of training. You don't seem to get it. You can sidestep till you're blue in the face, but if you don't attack me, you're a dead man! Ah! He's right. Even so, I've got to keep dodging him just to stay in the fight. He thinks he's so smart. There's no way I'm going to let him beat me. Get up! You're making us look bad, Daimon. You're not going to let the kid win, are you? Yeah, man. Don't give up now. What just happened? It's like I was able to use his momentum against him to throw him off. That's right. There's one thing I almost forgot to tell you. The strongest, most effective technique is one that you can use defensively and offensively at the same time. <clears throat> like this! You see? <laughs> so that's what she meant. I get it now. That's how the stepping method works. Daimonji, you sure you want to continue? Now you die! Now it all makes sense. When I get back into the right stance, I take an extra step forward and push with all my weight. Then I draw my opponent in using my momentum as I return to my stance. That way my defensive move becomes an offensive move. Hey, go and get me a bucket of water. Did you just see that? There's no way. Is this for real? He hit the ground head first. I can't believe it. That scrawny punk took him out. Uh, did I just win? Uh. Hey, that didn't count as a win, did it? That was a throwing move! You're pathetic. The loser has to quit the club. That's the promise the two of you made, right? <laughs> but that wasn't a legit karate move! The kid cheated! Uh, please, I just... I don't want to quit the club! Please don't make me quit karate! It's my life! <laughs> um, I was wrong. I know throwing moves are illegal. I shouldn't have done it during a match. He won the fight. He beat me fair and square, so I'll leave. Thank you very much. I got kicked out of the club after all. The warrior's back. Leave me alone. 
I'm really not in the mood for this. I'm just curious. How'd the fight turn out for you? I lost the match, all right. Word on the street is you lost the match because you made an illegal move. But you know, I can always tell when someone isn't telling the truth. And I think you and I both know that's not what happened here. That move may have been against tournament rules, but you were forced into a real fight. So no matter what anyone says about it, Kenichi, in my humble opinion, you won. Well, thank you very much. Hey, wait, did you just call me by my name? I think that's the first time you've called me anything other than weak knees or sissy boy or... As a reward for your victory, I've got some info. The guy who refereed your little fight session is pretty fired up. I think it's only right to give you fair warning and let you know that he's gunning for you. Hey, what? Are you kidding me? You'll have your hands full with that, Sakuba. After all, he is the most dangerous fighter in the karate club. Not to mention the fact that he's in tight with a gang of thugs. Sorry, buddy, but you're a dead man walking. <laughs> no. What am I gonna do? I'm every day. the Sakuba guy, I'm dead for sure! What's the matter with you now, Kanichi? There's no reason to panic. One of the seniors in the Karate Club has challenged me to a duel. There's no way I could possibly win. I'm gonna be ripped to shreds! A duel? Well, that's quite a situation you've gotten yourself into. What should I do? Don't you have any advice? The only way to win a duel is to train. That means 150 laps around the neighborhood pulling tires! But that'll kill me before I even get the chance to fight! 